U.S. Navy corpsmen educated Tanzania People's Defense Force medical team members with instructor techniques during a medical mentor workshop for the Tactical Combat Casualty Care Course, or TCCC. While working with Africa Partnership Station, we will not be here forever. The purpose of our visit is to mentor the trainers so that we, the Tanzanian Navy, could be self-sufficient in training each other in TCCC rather than relying on the U.S. to come back year after year. This APS training, it fits into a very small niche into a much broader program. It's critical because we're trying to build capacity within the Tanzanian military as we are across Africa. And what we're doing is helping the Tanzanians develop a medical capability, train the trainer program within their own Navy in order to assist with the VBSS program that we're working with them on. The training of VBSS, or Visit Board Search and Seizure Teams, is part of the broader APS mission focused on international cooperation. Lieutenant Colonel Beliski described maritime domain awareness as the ability for a country to project combat power out into the ocean. The, the challenges of piracy in the Indian Ocean affects, it has a global effect. And the more we can train together to combat that and to combat other uh, challenges that, that face maritime domain awareness, it eases future uh, engagement and, and provides us the ability to work more closely with these nations given the opportunity later and if we have to in times of conflict. Tanzania, along with other East Africa countries, will be part of the Cutlass Express exercise later this year, aimed at advancing maritime partnerships through training and collaborative activities in order to improve safety and security in the region. Petty Officer Anthony Martinez, Dar es Salaam, Tanzania.